This Making a Difference segment is sponsored by Insight Credit Union. It's your money. Keep it in sight. Thousands of our veterans are returning home with injuries from the battlefield. Morning Acre Bridget Ellison has more on how veterans are healing through equine therapy. The Heavenly Hoofs Therapeutic Riding Center in Kissimmee now offers a program called Horses and Heroes. It's been so popular, there's a waiting list. I lost my leg, my right leg above the knee. Riding Dallas the horse here at Heavenly Hoofs in Kissimmee is giving disabled veteran Christopher Gordon more confidence to try new things. Tackling something that uh, I never knew if I'd be able to do. Um, now I know I can do it. It gives me confidence to uh, take on other things that maybe I thought I wouldn't be able to do, like cycling and stuff like that. As vets with injuries or post traumatic stress disorder bond and heal through this equine therapy program, it could give doctors valuable insight for future treatments. About a year ago, uh, UCF College of Medicine contacted us and they wanted to start a program that uh, studied the effects of equine therapy with wounded veterans. And once Heavenly Hoofs expands to a new center next year, the Horses and Heroes program will be able to serve more than eight vets at a time. But so far, they're happy with the results in this one year old program. Sometimes the horses can touch you in ways that um, traditional therapy or traditional methods do not touch you. So the horses are really the therapists. We're just here to make sure everybody's safe. Is your saddle tight? Yes, I just tightened it. Okay. For more about horses and heroes, we posted a link at clickorlando.com. Just look under Scene on Six. And while you're online, email us about people and groups making a difference where you live. Send it to makingadifference at clickorlando.com. I'm Bridget Elson, and I'll see you in the morning.